let's dive in. Now, I have Natasha here because she makes me laugh. Probably because I don't work with anyone like her. But I'm sure some of you out there have a co-worker like Natasha, somewhat. And, you know, they're not pleasant to work with at all. There is one particular person in the room you need to be careful of. Who's that? Her name is Natasha. Come to find out nobody likes Natasha, and the co-workers do fear her. Stop it. See, Natasha is Mr. Blackshear's right-hand person. She's been working with him for over 20 years, and she is very competitive and envious of anybody else who can shine a little light bright in hers. She will stomp you out. She is that kind of worker. Yes, Natasha. Thank you so much for asking. I actually closed that deal last week. Everyone give it up for me. Wow. Did you run it by Natasha first? <laughs> Dominique, I don't have to run anything by Natasha. Yeah, and Natasha got everybody running from her because she has everyone so fearful and afraid of losing their jobs that she just run everybody off. And poor Wayne, cousin Asani, she got a chance to, to get a whiff of her little raft there a little bit. But back to Mike and Natasha exchange of bad energy with each other. Let me know and I will get with Mr. Blackshear and report whoever decides to disrespect you guys, okay? Yes, sir. You better watch how you speak to me and choose your words wisely. Because I would really hate for you to end up in the wrong bag of chips. And a bad bag of chips she got him in. Child, she went on down to the courthouse, ran into some old friends, showing all that leg. Okay, she knew what she was doing. We watching you, Natasha. But now she had them investigate uh, Mike and that little blue card that he got. We uh, we have to ask you a few more questions uh, mm -hmm. downtown. Feel mind. Downtown? Yeah, they were taking him for questioning, and I'm pretty sure Natasha loved all of this. Um, Jordan was acting all crazy and all scared. Mike was pretty cool. Now, the fellas, uh, the rest of the crew, they got him out of jail, and then Natasha was waiting for Mike with a big, uh, like, homecoming. She was so funny. Listen, you're home, man. Mm -hmm. While you're back from your bed, mm. I decided to take it upon myself to bake you a cake. I know Mike don't hit women, but I'm pretty sure he wanted to smash that cake in Natasha's face. So keep watching these two. It's definitely more to come. And uh, you never know. These two may have a love interest one day because you know this is like a comedy soap opera. So just stay tuned. I know I am. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye.